what's up everybody this is Dayton from Killinois Kennels coming back at you guys with another banger in today's video we're gonna be breaking down the prices of our next drop of America bully puppies that we're gonna have on this channel this right here is gonna be the father of the first litter this is our boy Killinois Kennels big business and this right here is gonna be the mother this is our girl Killinois Duchess in this video, we're going to show you plenty of footage of the puppies. We're going to number them and break down exact prices on each pup. If you're seriously interested in purchasing one, I highly recommend watching this video all the way through. This right here is going to be the father of the second litter. This is our boy, Killinois Kennels Tasmanian Panda. And this right here is going to be the mother. This is our girl, Killinois Kennels Mia. Both litters threw it down, and we got some crazy good deals coming up with these pups. Like I always tell you guys, I feel like we got the best prices versus quality that you'll find anywhere in the world, and we're gonna prove that in this video today. But that's enough for all that. Let's go ahead and get into the footage you guys all came here to see. We're gonna start off with the females from the Tasmanian Panda and Mia litter. And for anybody that wants to see more footage of the parents, make sure you check the link in the description. We got plenty of footage of the parents. We break down the pedigree and everything you want to know in those videos. In this video here today, we're just going to be showing you the pups and giving exact prices on each puppy. Also, for anybody that's looking to purchase one, you know, this footage in today's video is not going to be the absolute best footage of these pups. I'm in a rush trying to get this video done. If you're really interested in purchasing one, I highly recommend you go check out the videos. We got two different videos of both litters with about 15 minutes worth of footage of them. There will be a link in the description of both of those videos as well. But off of this litter, we ended up with three real nice females. We got the blue female on the left, the fawn female on the right, and the black tri female in the back. We're gonna go ahead and number them and put an exact price on each pup. That way you know exactly what you're trying to purchase. Right here is gonna be female number one, and this is gonna be the black tri female. She's probably the all around best pup off of this litter, and she's going for a steal of a deal for 3K plus shipping if need be. The pups are not numbered in no specific order. This is all random, and again, that's gonna be female number one. This is gonna be female number two, the fawn girl on the right. She's probably the biggest, bulliest pup off of this whole litter. Probably got the best head shape as well. She's gonna be going for 3,500 plus shipping. This right here is gonna be the blue female, another really nice pup off of this litter. We're gonna call her female number three, and she's gonna be going for 2,500 plus shipping if need be. So again, the black tri female is gonna be female number one. She's gonna be going for 3K. The fawn female is gonna be female number two. She's gonna be going for 3,500. And the blue female is gonna be female number three, and she'll be going for 25. Now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the males. On the left, we got the black tri boy. Real, real nice pup off of this litter. Just like the black tri female, this might be the most well-balanced boy. That razor's edge blood is creeping up out of these dogs like crazy, man. I can really see it. And just like the black tri boy, the blue fawn boy in the middle is another well-balanced pup. On the far right, we got the blue and white male with the white socks. He's gonna be the biggest male off of this litter, and he's probably got the biggest head as well. Like I said in the previous video on this litter, man, we ended up with a whole litter of nice show quality American bullies, and we couldn't be happier. With the males, we're gonna work from the right and work our way to the left. On the right, we're gonna have male number one, and this is gonna be the blue and white boy, and he's gonna be going for 2,500 plus shipping. Next up, we got the blue fawn male, another real nice pup off of this litter. He's gonna be going for 3,500 plus shipping if need be. Again, this is not the best footage of these pups. Make sure you guys go check out that other video. Next up, we got the black tri-male on the far left, 
he's gonna be mail number three and he's gonna be going for 3,000 plus shipping if need be. On both of these litters, man, we got some amazing deals and you will not find this quality for this cheap anywhere. And I promise you that. This litter just hit four months old, will come ABKC registered, up to date on shots, worm, ears cropped, everything like we always do over here at the Kill the Noise camp. But now let's go ahead and move on to the next litter. Now we're to go ahead and move on to the big business and Dutch's pups. And we ended up with three females and two males out of this litter. We got some really good deals going on with these puppies as well. We have a couple pet quality pups and we also have some foundation pups in this litter. So make sure you guys stay tuned. We've been having a lot of people ask us in the comment section about our pups and our dogs and what they are, pockets and standards. With this litter here, Big Business is gonna be a pocket American bully, and our girl, Duchess, is gonna be a standard American bully female. Both real nice dogs. When we breed over here, we like to breed right on that borderline of pocket and standard. So some litters, we're gonna have some pockets, and some litters, we're gonna have some standards. But all dogs are gonna be right there on that borderline, and that's what we like over here. We like a nice medium-sized dog, not too big and not too small. And that's what we shoot for off of every litter over here at the Kill the Noise camp. As a buyer, I wouldn't concentrate on that too much as far as if the dogs are pocket or standard. I would more worry about whether I was getting a nice quality bull. And that's exactly what we're trying to provide for all of you guys. From the left to the right, on the very left, we got a red male. That's gonna be a pet quality male, real nice boy. Next to him, we got the blue and white male, and this is gonna be my favorite male from this litter, man. Real, real nice dog right there. In the middle, we got the black and white female, and just like the blue boy, she's another one of my favorites from this litter. Next to her, we got a red female, another pet quality dog, but super nice as well. On the far right, we got the chocolate and white female, and just like the blue boy and the white girl, man, she's another one of my favorite pups. Between those three dogs, I couldn't actually pick my favorite, but I'll tell you what, man, these are gonna be real nice foundation dogs for anybody that's trying to start a kennel, trying to get in the bully game, or any of that stuff. And as far as the pet quality pups go, these pups are gonna be perfect for anybody that's trying to save a little bit of money but still get a nice badass American bully you know these pups will serve any purpose that you need they just have a little kink in their tail it's really not that big deal of all for anybody that wants to just take their dog around show it off a little bit and just have a badass pet these are going to be perfect for that we have a lot of people asking us, can they breed the pet quality dogs? And yes, you're more than welcome to do whatever you want with this dog. If you were looking to start a kennel, I wouldn't recommend one of these pet dogs, but I'll tell you what, if you just want a badass dog and you decide you love this dog and you wanna have a litter with it, it's not gonna hurt to have a litter with it. With that being said, we're not sitting here trying to encourage people to breed their dogs, but a lot of people are spending money with these dogs, and we're not going to tell you what you're going to do with them, because no matter what, you're going to do what you want anyways. You know what I mean? We're just realistic about the situation, so you know we're not encouraging people to buy pet quality dogs and go breed them all over the place. But if you want to have a litter with your dog, you love your dog, and you want something to remember them by, it's not gonna hurt anything just like with the first litter we're gonna start with the females and this is gonna be the black and white female like I said man one of my favorites from this litter this girl's gonna be going for 5k plus shipping if need be we're gonna call her female number four that way there's no confusion so again female number four 5k Next up, we got this real nice chocolate female, and just like the female you previously seen, this is gonna be another one of my favorites from the litter, and we got amazing steal of a deal going on with this girl right now. She's got that chocolate color, and that brings a lot to the table. She's gonna be going for 3,500 plus shipping if need be, and we're gonna call her female number five. Next up, 
we got this red female in between the white female and the chocolate female this is going to be the pet quality girl and she's going to be going for 2k plus shipping if need be she has just a little little bitty kink at the very end of her tail man it's actually you know this is a really nice girl man unfortunately she does have that little kink and that's why she's going to be going for 2k if she didn't have that kink she'd be going for twice of that she's a really nice girl put together really well and we're going to call her female number six these pups are not numbered in no specific order and we're gonna number them like this that way nobody's confused and we ain't got people calling about female number one from two different litters and you know just make things a lot easier for everybody now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the males and we're gonna start with this blue boy on the left and again this is gonna be another one of my favorites from this litter we're gonna go ahead and call him male number four and he's gonna be going for 4k plus shipping if need be that's gonna be a steal of a deal on this boy man this boy is gonna be a monster now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the last male and that's gonna be the boy all the way on the far right he's gonna be the pet quality male we're gonna call him male number five and he's gonna be going for 2k plus shipping if need be just like the female with the kink if this boy didn't have this kink he'd be going for twice the amount this boy is put together really really well outside of that kink tail and it just is what it is man so again this is going to be male number five and he'll be going for 2k plus shipping if need be these pups just hit five months old and they're going to be coming with abkc papers up to date on shots wormed ears cropped the whole nine yards you know we haven't decided if we're going to put these puppies up for sale this sunday or we're going to hold off and wait till the next sunday after that for those of you that are seriously interested in purchasing one of these american bully puppies let us know in the comment section if you want us to put them up for sale this sunday or wait for the sunday after that majority rules and that's how we're gonna play it man so let us know in the comment section and just as excited as you guys are to add one of our american bullies to your family we can't wait to add all you guys to the killinois family and we're gonna be adding 11 new members coming up here really soon for those of you that think it's super hard to get a puppy from our litter we decided to go ahead and put two litters up for sale at the same exact time that way it can make it a lot easier for a lot of you guys to get pups so for those of you that think it's impossible man there's going to be plenty of chances coming up and we're going to be looking forward to talking to all of you guys on that sunday let us know in the comment section when we should put them up for sale and let's hit that 10k likes and 10k comments and we'll go ahead and do a puppy giveaway off of this drop right here make sure you hit that like button comment on these videos share them all over the place man and we're gonna do a puppy giveaway right now if you haven't already make sure you guys get over to instagram follow us at killinoy underscore kennels we just hit 10k followers on there i need to update this thumbnail right here and you know also make sure you guys get over there to TikTok and follow us at killinoy kennels as well we just reached over a thousand followers on there man we've been dropping a lot of exclusive content that you guys do not see on youtube so again make sure you guys get over there and check us out I want to send a major shout out to the Killinois family, everybody that's purchased a dog from our kennel, everybody's taking real good care of them dogs and sending out us footage to put up on the channel. Big shout out to you guys. I also want to send a shout out to all of our supporters, everybody showing love on the videos, hitting that like button, commenting, sharing our videos, telling their friends about our channel. We're creeping up on 60,000 subscribers and we couldn't have got there without all your guys' help, man. We got major things coming to the channel. Make sure you guys stay tuned. I'm telling you, man, you guys ain't ready for what we got coming.